I hope when people walk in here, they feel a sense of joy and happiness. I like to think of it as an escape. I think this place is kind of a break from the real world. Funny Face Bakery is the first pop culture bakery. We're constantly inspired by trending news and pop culture, and we make that into baked goods. We are known for taking what is trending in the world and making it into cookie art. We also have the best gooey cookies in New York City. We were just voted number one chocolate chip cookie on Insider. The chocolate chip one is my favorite. So you could get a decorated cookie or a big chunky gooey cookie. We originally started out as a cupcake bakery in 2016. Two weeks before, I had an idea that a face belonged on a cookie. It was the primaries going on, so I thought, okay, opening day, I'll do Trump, Hillary, and Bernie. Opening day comes, no one wants the cupcake, everyone wants the face cookies. One day I just went for it and hired a bunch of artists and we came up with a list of celebrities that we loved that was trending. And from there on out, we decided to become a pop culture bakery where we would make our cookies into edible art. I always drew as a little girl. In high school, I had my own Etsy store. I used to sell little comic books. I originally went to art school. I always wanted to be an artist, and I love baking. I also love movies and TV shows and what's going on in the world, so I wanted to combine the three all together. Originally, I was the artist that did all the illustrations for custom cookies, but doing this business, I got to work with really talented illustrators that illustrate the designs. It's not about just tasting good, but also visually how they work. We have a team of very talented artists that put a lot of love into piping and decorating the cookies. We have a staff around 40 people currently working for us. We post online that we're currently looking for artists. They'll send us their resume of their beautiful artwork and we'll see how they pipe on cookies. We've been seeing a trend of dark, very sarcastic humor. We have a cookie of a rainbow that says anxiety in the middle. That's been very popular. We have a cookie suggestion box. It really keeps us with what's up to date, what people want. When we first started, movie stars were really big. Now we're seeing work and memes are really big, TikTok stars are really big. We definitely do try to introduce new designs monthly if anything's new trending or even if something like crazy in the media happens overnight, we try to get that design in in a week. Our most memorable design is probably the Kim K crying one, the Kardashians. They're really the ones that put us on the maps. Most popular cookie definitely have to be the New York City cookies. Uh, we're just such a New York City brand, so um, I think a bunch of tourists get them, maybe some New Yorkers get them, but we've always saw those as our best sellers. Gooey flavors, we usually introduce new flavors every two months. This month it's pretzel chip cookie, which is like savory and sweet, and we have a banana and a cookie coming out, which I'm really excited about. We try to be a bit quirky, but not too quirky, but a bit nostalgic with our flavors. Like we have a s'mores cookie, we have of course Funfetti, we had a Rice Krispie one, which was delicious. We have oatmeal raisin. When a customer first walks in, we usually hear, oh my God, or a lot of laughter. Uh, usually they'll walk in with a friend and it's really just a place where people could bond together and have a shared experience if they see a cookie that remind them of something that they've been through together. It makes me feel so happy when I see them reacting to the cookies. You were very much inspired by Polly Pocket, <laughs> so we wanted you to feel like you were walking into Polly Pocket's home. We ship nationwide. We're hoping to ship across the world, but right now just nationwide. Custom cookie, nothing is off limits. We've done so many things. He sent us a picture. We have an in-house illustrator that does an illustration of it. Once that's approved, goes into production. Cookies get cut out, colors are made, and then the artists type on the cookie. We usually ask for a week and a half notice. We do rush orders, but Definitely around the holidays, uh, best to plan in advance. When I see the customers happy with the designs and that I know that I give, we've given them an experience, it definitely um, fills my day. It reminds me why I wanted to open up a bakery.